<laughs> I would never stay out of sight. This. You, you had no right. I had every right. I am your mother. You had no right, witch. I can't taste. I can't smell. I can't even feel the temperature of this, this room. Feasting, drinking, women. It's all gone. God to feel pain again. Death has no power over you now. You would rather die? Never feel again? Yes. Yes. I would rather die. Yes. Take it away, Mom. I can't. Please. Please. Please take it away. It doesn't work like that. Son. Trust me in time. What you did to me. What you did to me! Freya is his mother. Why did you keep this from us, Head? Would you believe it slipped my mind? I would not. Uh, I'm at a loss. I assure you, you have no reason to keep such a thing a secret. There's the boat. We will speak more of this. Soon. Sure, this is seaworthy. She will do. Great. Just bear in mind this boat can only take us part of the way. Tyr's temple is near the top of a tremendous waterfall, which, sadly, we are downstream. That means even if we get there intact, We'd still need to sail up a waterfall somehow. The Vanir built the greatest ship that ever was, and it can fly. Skiffbothnir? Yeah, because it was designed to fly. This was not. Nevertheless, this is the boat we have. We may do. Stop. And perhaps the biggest iceberg I've ever seen. At least the fire's making heat. What now? Chopping it? Give me a fire so now the sails are loose? Just watch. You cut the sails loose. So now, we're pulling the sails down? But how are they going to catch the wind? We're floating! The heat from the fires! We're actually floating! And we're stuck. Not for long. Stay with the boat. Wait for me there! 
And that boy up there, he's in nine kinds of pain. His head's turned so far around he... Atreus is not your concern. Well, it might become everyone's concern if you don't do something. You don't have to be the smartest man in the world to see that. Atreus. I can help? Together now. We did it! We're free! Ed, how long before we reach the temple? Yeah, it's freezing. As long as we maintain this speed and those fires don't go out, we should be there in no time, lad. Staying lit. Could you believe magic? Or are those blades? has his reasons. Might I have a look? Well, this is most unexpected. Why? What does it mean? I haven't the foggiest. Isn't that unexpected? Head. Look, clearly that's Tyr. Traveling somehow. Perhaps magically. But what's that to do with the giants that they should devote a shrine to it? I'm afraid that is none too clear. What are those runes in the corners? Not runes. Symbols from different lands. They mean 
War. Aye. How do you... This one I know too well. Oh. His eyes. They are jewels. Like yours. No doubt signifying the gift of sight the giants granted us. Give me a closer look. Interesting. Very interesting. What is that? Secret plans concealed by Tyr so none could access but him. And those few others the giants trusted. And right under Odin's nose, ho ho ho! I did promise I'd get you to Jotunheim. What do you mean, Ed? You said we were out of options. Don't you see, brother? Odin never gave up hope, and neither should we. He knew there was a clue in here, but we're the ones who found it. These plans are for a key to some chamber tears kept hidden. I don't know where it's leading or what we'll find, but it's a path. How do we make this key? I suggest we ask a dwarf. That symbol on the temple door. It's a bunch of runes together. Peace, unity, hope, other things too. Tears own design. He made this door himself. Boy. Before. When you. saw. I didn't see anything. You did not see me with someone. An old man. What old man? Can we go? Yes. Very well. All right, let's get back to Midgard and see about making that key. Where's that dwarf? tell us Balder is the son of Freya. He is! It's shocking every time I hear it, and yet obviously I know it. When I think about Balder and Freya... The mayor? Yes, lad. <laughs> Freya. How's that, brother? Hey, tell me Balder's vulnerability. Balder is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. Wait, what is happening? He is bewitched not to speak of what he knows. I am? I am! Oh, that's it precisely! I wonder how long that's been so. Since she had my head at her mercy, or back when I figured out Baldur's weakness. I'm here! Yes, lad? You just said you figured out Baldur's weakness. Did I? But Baldur is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. <sighs> Enough. This means there is a way. If he troubles us again, we will find it. Can you make it? Is it a weapon? Armor? Or likewise an instrument of war, of which I'm a master at shaping? No? Then forget it. Even if I wanted to make such an insignificant goo-gaw, I'm liable to chink my tools working on something so delicate and ladylike. Then shingle it. How to weld the item with scap slag. Keep the layers thin. Alternate the overlay. Okay, smart guy. And where do you propose to find a lump of quality scap slag? Last time I saw one, I could still get rigid down south. Shut your mouth, is that? Where did you? I had to get my hands dirty. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> well, don't just stand there. Hey, let's do this. What? You? You're fine with working on something that's not a weapon? Oh, hell, why not? <laughs> what? I can grow too. Oh, watch, watch the spine. Keep your wrist loose. No, you keep your wrist loose. Yeah, I need more heat here. Coming up. You gonna temper that steel longer? I don't need to. I triple quenched it with Draugr. See, how inventive and sanitary. You clever little beaver. Never too late to learn a new trick, is it? <laughs> no, it's not. Yeah. Here it is. Nope. Don't forget this. you're grinning. It's downright unsettling. <laughs> it's just nice to see you together. But now the rune on your brand looks different. Yeah, price of uh, reforging something what broke. I knew it. You two love each other. Oh, cut it out, Francis. You're gonna get me all weak. I like the new one better. Don't you? We have work to do. No. 